Ben and Vanessa. And you're late to the party on to the next episode of Agatha All Along. So many of you guys showed up for that last episode, which was a doozy. We've got uh, Wiccan back, and apparently it is Billy William uh, Maximoff, Maximoff, according to Disney+. Plus. Well, yeah, according to the social medias of Marvel Studios and Disney Plus and all of that, because, you know, hashtag Billy Maximoff. So it's interesting that they decided to do it that way. I feel like it would have been kind of cool to kind of still be like, okay, well, which Billy are you type situation? But right. there, I'm sure there are more things like for surprise that I'm, I'm like, okay, cool. Now we have that bit of information, but how did we get to that um, um, resolution, I guess? I don't, I don't. I guess I wouldn't even call it a resolution. Just that whole thing with Billy. <laughs> how did we travel down the road to get to this exact point when there it comes go. to Billy right. uh, themselves? So yeah. uh, looking forward to uh, seeing how it all plays out because in that last episode, it was just in turmoil and everybody got sucked into the swamp. <laughs> Mucky muck. Yes, and we lost another member of our coven, Alice. Alice. I mean, shame. she was a protective uh, protection witch or protector um, and she... You know, used her powers to pr try to protect Agatha and unbeknownsing or she might have known that that she you know took her power so but we'll guys see. uh it is a spooky season we just put out a vlog of our trip to nightfall which is a haunted experience at old tucson studios which yeah. is an actual studio where a lot of westerns were filmed uh so check that out it is available on our channel right now and you can check out our reactions to the most recent episodes of The Penguin, which is incredible. Those reactions are on our channel as well. But let's get into the newest episode of Agatha All Along. Now. now. This time. Because he was a familiar. I'm a Dapper Dan kind of man. Our religion's just boring in every language, isn't it? <laughs> You're a man now. <laughs> Mazel tov. Mazel tov. And we love you more than we could ever hope to communicate in human words. It's the calm before the storm. Oh. That doesn't seem very kosher. Ah, then. Are we looking behind us or ahead? You were there the whole time? Interesting. Uh, don't tell me everything. I don't want to know too much. Spoilers. <laughs> this journey will be one of great transformation and... And tragedy? You're becoming a man. Nope. A new you. Yes. <laughs> a regeneration of sorts. The tower reversed. I just remembered something, I think. Something that'll happen later? Enjoy the now, baby. It's the only thing that's certain. Live in the now. <laughs> <laughs> was she the one that did the sigil? Oh, she, she was the one. Oh, why? You don't remember doing it. No. She already forgot. Interesting. And I love how the fact when she was the one, too, that said, oh, someone put a sigil on that boy. Yeah, she, she was the one. We've just been informed there's something happening with the anomaly in Westview. Oh. Nobody needs to go home. Are you guys in Eastview? That could be the final fight between her and Agatha. Oh, shoot. There it is. Is it going away? Mom, it's out. No. Yeah, it was Eastview. Oh. oh, so this was at the end. Oh, because you were a rubbernecker. Billy went splat. William! Is he okay? Oh, oh no! What? <laughs> William, Jeff, you look! I hear him dark. William! I mean, it hit pretty hard on his end. Did we can jump in? So sad. Is he breathing? Yes. yes, he is now. Okay. Thank God. Don't move him. There's an ambulance on the way. They were all connected before. Do you remember what happened? He'll be okay. And to everyone else, it's like amnesia. Oh my gosh. I mean, this is better than just not existing, right? 
Kaplan. I guess, but poor little Will, like original William. He was going to die anyways, but at the same we time, it was because of, I mean, fate. It happened. It's the only thing that's certain. Still. He died. Still. I feel bad for parents. He's going to make fun of who? It's a little hostile. Amnesia. Well, just take a little time to resolve on its own. That's all. Or not resolve at all. Uh, Pupper's nose. Yeah, Papa's nose. Is it cute Pupper's though? <laughs> it's got that patch like our dog. What if he just stays like this? Over. Restaurant. Give me my son back. Be okay. Stop worrying! God, how agonizing is that, though? Oh, wow. You don't know anything. I know. But that's amnesia, you know, in a nutshell. Maybe I just need to see my room. (laughs) Now it's like, now which door is mine? (laughs) Little Wizard of Oz in the background. I'm William Kaplan. I am William Kaplan. Doesn't feel true. Nope, it does not. Damn. Three years later. I had fun. I'm just going to say, William Kaplan, I love you. I... Too soon? Maybe you can say it now. (laughs) Say it first. I died that night. And when I came back, I was different. Something more. In a world of superpowers, it makes sense. Yeah. Because I love you, too. (laughs) There it is. Yay. (laughs) You love me, too. (laughs) If you're not William Kaplan, who are you? Billy Maxima. Damn, they're going to end the episode by the time we catch up, probably. <laughs> probably. <laughs> so on the night of the oh, accident, the craft. Got the craft on the wall and yeah. Carrie. Probably don't want Carrie as an influence. That level of flawless should be illegal. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I love how they're like sprinkling them in a little bit throughout the episode. Those are runes. People who were there refused to talk about it. I did find this guy on Reddit. Ralph Boner. Yeah, who is it? I think that's him. It probably is him, isn't it? Are you craft crazy 17? Yep, sounds like him. Bonerific 69. There it is. (laughs) (laughs) You got it back. You can just call me Ralph. (laughs) Randall, call me Randall. (laughs) I remember everything. Wanda had the whole town acting out this weird... Sad sitcom plot. Wanda Maximoff? You want to hear this or not, bub? <laughs> bub. It was not a good time. Yeah, and he was one of the main characters, too, you know? A little bit, yeah. Can you, like, do stuff? Stuff you couldn't do before. Like your speed? What are you talking about? <laughs> Never mind. Please ask about Agatha Harkness. What do you know about Agatha Harkness? Oh, come on! <laughs> yeah, that's who is on the trail. She's an ancient freaking witch who will F your shit up. Wait, right? Mr. Bonerific! <laughs> Mr. Bonerific. <laughs> I mean, whatever. Yeah, really messed with his mind, man. Agatha hijacked my life. She stole my house. Completely ruined the market value. Oh. God. I was a terrible influence on one of Vision's kids. Dang. And I poisoned a dog. He poisoned Sparky. Twins. What were their names? Billy and Tommy. The little speedster and his mind reading brother. That's you, boo. After that, I cut and run. Left my entire Blu-ray collection behind. <laughs> Agatha can keep my Bullflex. <laughs> I heard she was under some kind of spell or something. Acting like a normal resident. So she's harmless. Did I say that? I did not say that! You know. Hey! You seriously do not know what kind of crazy that lady eats for breakfast. Except cash or uh, maybe half-off tickets to my one-man show on Karamas. Oh, God. <laughs> I really need to fill seats. Aww. Aww. I like that they brought him back, though. I, I love having these connections to WandaVision. Yeah, me too. And it was a great way to fill in the information that uh, Billy was missing. He had to go home. Oh, man, I made that pot roast you like so much. I even made the potatoes in the air fryer. Dang. Mm. The lean night. Of all that's fallen fair. Oh, listening mm. to the song. Doing research. Bruhapedia. I love it. Yep, your brother. So that's how we pull Tommy into this world. An important personal 
item. Oh. <laughs> You're my black heart. Black heart, huh? I've been digging the music this entire episode. We get to see her like pretending. Yeah, that's pretty personal. Yeah, you suck. Stop! I didn't realize it, but is she wearing a shirt that says boner on it? I mean, she did steal his house. Help you. Police! Please don't call the police. I can't have a criminal record. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> so this is how you kind of give us the other side of the story, but fill in the blanks a little more effectively. Bram! <laughs> Hooligan? Why is it different? Didn't he get hit because by a car? Because in her, in her he, he like got ran over the car, but in her mind, it went differently because she's a decorated detective all right she saw it <laughs> so, sure she saw it way different okay. yeah Break like right now technically in her mind is, we're yeah, at the station yeah this is what's actually happening yeah yeah does so say talk boner family the reunion bag. Yeah. what were you looking for in my home Ow! <laughs> never kicked him out of the chair <laughs> you want to keep poking the bear i do not want to poke the bear no you don't no i don't <laughs> There you go. That'll work. That won't work. <laughs> Tell me who she is. Who? Tell me what happened to her! What are you talking about? These are just flowers. Because you took her trinket? What are you doing? That's really tight. Shut your mouth. Come on, I do not want to go back in the closet. There's his DVDs, his Blu-rays. Oh, yeah? <laughs> well, he doesn't want to go back in the closet? I get it. My name is William Kaplan. Say again. I'm Billy Maximoff. Woo! He said it! <laughs> and back on the road. Pick up from where we left off. You got out. <laughs> it's like the mud in uh, Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. It's all, like, slimy. Don't need it anymore. No. It is now broken. That was quite a debut. I had a feeling when we first met, even with the sigil in the way, you and your mother have the same towel. Which is? Very inconvenient for you. I wasn't sure, sure, until... <laughs> <laughs> it's nice to see you again, Billy. You can hear me now. Every witch with a beating heart can hear you now. I mean, I've killed uh, mm, a lot. <laughs> My share. <laughs> I'm not like you. Where have I heard that before? Your mama. Where did you come by this fresh body you're wearing? Don't you dare feel guilty about your talent. You survived like witches have been doing for centuries. So you broke the rules. Big deal. That's what makes you special. There you go. Be motherly. You want now. a son, he wants a mom. If we're going to make it to the end. We. But I don't need you anymore. <laughs> don't get so cocky, you little witch. I don't know if I ever did. Dang. <laughs> you know it's there. I can finish the road on my own. With all that power you can't control without throwing a temper tantrum. I'll figure it out. What does Billy Maximoff want at the end of the road. Right! There's two of you! You're after Toby! <laughs> Tommy. <laughs> Tommy. T-Bone. That's what I said. Gosh, you really are a Maximoff. Otherwise, none of this would be nearly as dramatic. <laughs> <laughs> I do not trust you. At all. It's a good start. Ever. Got it. Got it. Let's go find the next trial. Last one there is a nice person. But what about the others? And Rio. And Re yeah. I'm not that nice. And that could be your downfall because Agatha's going to play into that. Woo! Dang. Well, Kay. they filled us in. They did fill us in. <laughs> We've Quite got our uh, answers, our questions answered. There we go. Sure. Yeah. And it... Uh, 
it took majority of the episode to give it to us. And I do like the way it was constructed. I think it is, it's done well in this episode to show us the pieces of the puzzle and showing us the same scenarios, but how it actually went down. Uh, and I thought it was, a, a, you know, it, very well informative too, for those of us that may have forgotten mm. what took place, but kind of retold the story in a new, fresh way without yeah. having to just show scenes from WandaVision to get right. us there. Yeah. So the veil has been lifted on Billy Maximoff and I love it because now this is a whole new dynamic from what we had with Billy and Agatha for the first half of the season. Now it's completely different because now it's Billy Maximoff and Agatha both have reason to not trust the other and also not like the other. So I want to see where these two witches and how these two witches are going to kind of bond and grow uh, when already having this antagonism against each other because of the past and what took place in WandaVision. Right. Um, the the events that unfolded to, you know, it sucks for William Kaplan and everything that he went through. Um, but uh, Billy did take the opportunity or uh, uh, seize, seize the moment, I guess. Um, and now he's uh, back and is wanting to find his brother. But maybe we'll find more than just his brother. Maybe we'll find, I don't know, somebody over here. But um, <laughs> I, <laughs> you I, never know. <laughs> I think it's an absolute possibility. I think yeah. it will happen. I think it will happen after we eventually get whatever happened with Vision. But uh, right now, I think it's just going to be the road to Tommy. Yes. So we can at least, you know, get that crew back. And, you know, if they ever wanted to do the Young Avengers, we need them. So uh, I do feel like, you know, it's going to take... It took this it's long just to time. get to Wiccan to get to Tommy. So I feel like Wanda's going to be far down that road. Just a little bit. But you know who wasn't far down that road is Ralph Boner. Yes. <laughs> they doubled down. They were like, yeah, we you know you guys got all pissed off because he was a dumbass. So we're going to make him a conspiracy theorist dumbass and put him here with what? with a little bit with of actual, you know, insight. I was going to say, yeah, with actual a little bit more insight because he was and there. The tears. He, you know, he um, lived. Lived it, yeah. I guess. Yeah. I do like that. You know, uh, Evan Peters did come back to play that because they could have, they could have not done that. And they could have just, you know, mentioned right. that they got information uh, and just do it like an online thing. But no, they they did bring him back, and he had like that small little scene there, um, just to get you know some information. And I do like that we got to see like the aftermath of what happened uh, with you know people who were in Westview right. when everything went down and then everything like stopped, like when Wanda stopped it. So, and how yeah. it affected some more than others, because we right. saw a little bit of Wanda vision of some, some of them would, that would break the spell yeah. and how panicked they were. Cause they were under control, but then go right back into the spell. Yes. Ralph Boner was a big part of the final act of Wanda vision. Those last few episodes and not, uh, it wasn't Wanda doing it. It wasn't. I was going to say it wasn't Wanda doing it. It was also so his mind was like played by both of them. Sure. Because, yes, he was in the in the West View and like the whole bubble. So he was a part of that sort of. But then Agatha came and, you know, played him as a puppet. So he had even more yeah. of like an effect on him. That's what made him really go over the edge there. Yeah. But I do love how Billy asked him about like, did you bring anything back with you? Any powers from there? Yeah. So, you know, it would be great if Evan Peters could be Quicksilver in some fashion, but do they need to do it? No. no. Um, but it, it would be, you know, kind of fun. I think they already kind of burned the whole Quicksilver aspect, Pietro thing with WandaVision and then kind of solidifying the Ralph Bonerism. Uh, here, but yeah, uh, yeah, I, I, I think that whole storyline is probably going to be done with Quicksilver, at least pertaining to Evan Peters. Yeah. Maybe we'll get one down the line. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's, I'm, I'm intrigued for the next episode once again because I feel like we only got a little bit 
post end of the last episode so we still have a lot more uh explaining to do when it comes to what happened to the others and what's going down on the witch's road but right looking forward to it what did you think of this episode uh of backstory for william maximoff let us know in the comments below you can also like and subscribe and do the thing on our facebook twitter tumblr instagram discord all the social networking gin joints you do where they are it stumbled all over those words Kick into the party, fuel the party, keep the party going on our Patreon. Make sure you check out that vlog from Nightfall at Old Tucson Studios. Halloween event available now on the channel. Thanks so much. And as always, now it's time to say goodbye. This party is over. Bye. Bye.